All right, time for an example, fellow math nerds and HP calculator nerds. Nerds, I mean. All right, let's use the HP 15C uh, to show an example of the programming capabilities of this. All right, so we've got a clock face. All right, what I want you to do is write a program to tell me the distance between the tips of the hour and the minute hand at any given time. All right, so we've got, that's a four, yeah, four inch minute hand, two and a half inch hour hand. That's gonna come in handy here in a minute. We'll see why. I'm not gonna go through all the math, but I'll show you the bottom line here, okay? Distance, distance between hour and minute hands, given z, y, and x, the stack, in the calculator, link to the minute hand first, link to the hour hand, and the time. And we'll just do decimal format. All right, the math is basically vector math. You have the minute and the hour hand with theta m and theta h for the angle coming from 12 o'clock down to where it is. And you can see all the vector math to end up at what is this distance here? Well, you got to figure out what that vector is in i and j format first, given all the angles and all that you know the distance you know the length of the minute and hour hand the angle you can figure out all this stuff back solve and then so the distance here is right there that's the formula now so the program uses the fractional value and the integer value of the time that you enter calculates like what percentage through the sweep it is and therefore what percent of 360 degrees it is and that's how it figures out the the angles okay and then plugs it into the vector math okay, and I've got I guess you could heck, if you want to steal a program and plug it in yourself go for it maybe take a screenshot of that right there page one is on the right page two on the left it's called program D uh, and and again you just enter length of the minute hand enter and link to the hour hand enter the time and decimal format so like 4.10 means 410 uh, 11.35 means 1135 not in not it not in decimal just just as it sounds and then the program does the rest so let's just do a real life example what time is it, it is it's gonna be 659 okay let's do it thing up okay uh, okay four inches that's the hour hand no minute hand 2.5 is the hour hand and then it is 659 and it's uh, so D program D it's doing all that stuff figuring out what percent of the way through the sweep it is calculating the angle uh, blah 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 taking the fractional the energy portion which I write here uh, integer fraction. Anyway, 6.2 inches. Let's verify it. It's probably tough to see that, but boom. Uh, it's really tough to get it lined up, but uh, Yeah, it's hard, but it, yeah, I can see it with my eyes. It's, the camera is just tough to see it, but yeah, 6.2. As my old, one of my old math teachers used to say, the math is smarter than the both of us.